A rare transition in the planets can be seen in the sky today. Thanksgiving is approaching and some wild turkeys are actually bullying people in Jersey. And Six Flags is coming at us with yet another interesting challenge. I'm Bianca Velasquez from the NJ.com newsroom and you're listening to Today in NJ on November 11th. A rare sky event known as the Mercury Transit is happening today and there's only 13 or 14 of these each century. It's when Mercury takes a path across the face of the sun and it lasts about five and a half hours. Now, the Mercury transit blocks just a small fraction of the sun's light from shining on the Earth. It'll basically look like a small black dot on the sun. To see it for yourself, you would need a telescope or binoculars, but you would still need to protect your eyes from being damaged because you are looking at the sun, so you would need a special solar filter on the lens. NASA says people will be able to see it as soon as the sun is visible in the sky. For us, it starts at 7.35 in the morning today, and it'll last until 1.04 p.m. And if you do want to see it, but you can't be outside today, you can watch the transit live on a video feed. And a couple of those websites are timeanddate.com and accuweather.com. We had to know the turkeys would be coming for us one of these Thanksgivings, but there's a group of around 40 to 60 wild turkeys causing chaos in a Jersey community. And apparently they're not afraid to get aggressive. They've been running around a 55 and older housing community in Tom's River, and they've broken windows and even try to bite people. There's an estimated 20,000 to 23,000 wild turkeys living in New Jersey alone. So I might be going vegetarian this holiday just to be safe. Six Flags Great Adventure has another new challenge, and it's a frigid twist on the polar plunge. They're doing a polar coaster challenge set for December 7th, where you'll have the chance to ride the Nitro roller coaster in shorts and a tank top. Nitro is one of the biggest coasters in the park. It goes 230 feet in the air, and it goes 80 miles per hour. I mean, imagine feeling December weather at that height and speed. T-shirts with elbow length or shorter sleeves, gloves, and secured hats are also allowed, but that doesn't mean it'll be easy. It's free with park admission, and it's open to all ages as long as you meet that 54-inch or taller mark. I mean, I'd love to go to this challenge to watch with a coat and some hot chocolate, maybe. Those were your stories of the day. And as always, thank you so much for listening to Today in NJ. Make sure you guys stay warm tonight because temperatures are supposed to drop later tonight into tomorrow. Have a great Monday.